And we're here at Sugar Shack Mushrooms with Elisa, and we're going to go through dry bagging. Yeah, so we're going to make a 10 pound bag. This is the unicorn bio bags that they're selling now. Um, put it on my scale here. I like to get the light on there and tear it up. And we'll make a uh, shiitake bag here, which is 80% sawdust, 20% wheat bran. Uh, we've got these containers by volume weighed out. Um, just so it's really easy, you don't have to think about it when you're making the bag. Do two scoops. We've got it portioned out like this so that it's easy to switch between five and 10 pound bags because I just do two scoops for a 10 pounder or one scoop for a five pounder. And then we're putting in wheat bran here, um, which we, same thing, do two of these. So that's all of our dry materials. Usually, uh, if we're doing it with two people, we kind of have the whole table. One person will be bagging here, and another person will be standing on this watering perch because we built this table too high. <laughs> and um, then topping off the water uh, to. 4,444 kilograms. Oh, that was pretty good. Oh, that was a good one. Oh, nailed it. <laughs> Sometimes not so much. Um, yeah, and then these guys. Yeah, every time. We always get it just right. Um, and then. We've learned to really value folding it neatly because it makes sealing the bag afterwards a lot easier. So Yeah, like if there's any stuff up here. Yeah, stuff up here really gets in the way or if like it gets folded up and crinkled, that can really cause problems when you're sealing, which is just leads to frustration in the lab. Um, so we stack them all up like this and usually this table gets like filled up with them and then we roll up our cart here and I actually usually sit on this table and load the barrel in right from the top of this. Um, so it's really pretty fast. It takes us about half an hour to make like 300 pounds of substrate this way wow. um, with two people or one hour by yourself. It's not bad uh, part of the mushroom chore list. Um, so it's, yeah, it's very painless. Do you know what the weight of the, uh, the pellets is? Um, yeah, we, I actually forget, we should weigh it out right now. Um, I've had it like just pre-measured for so long that I've forgotten. Um, so yeah, it's like 1,600 of pellets and 400 of wheat bran uh -huh. to get the 80-20% in the 10 pound or I guess 800 and then 200 uh, if we're making a five pound bag. And then it's, it's 2,200 grams. Yeah. And then, and then adding the same amount of water. Yeah, basically the same amount of water gets added. So 50%, I guess. Mm -hmm. I always get confused with the percentages. Like, is it 50% of the dry total or the total right. weight, including the water? Right. So I guess wet substrate, like half of it is water. Yeah. Um, so yeah, that's how we add it up. Cool. And same thing for our master's mix, except that it's 50-50 with our soybean hulls. Mm -hmm. um, and we found those to be kind of tricky to source around here. It's always kind of an adventure restocking our soybean hulls. <laughs> yeah. um, but we've been fortunate to have some for now. We still have enough to work with for the summer. Great. Yeah. Um, yeah, that's that process. Cool.